Hello everyone, Eric Covey here, host of Score Contracts YouTube channel, the most famous government contract channel on the web, taught by an active US government contractor. We're bringing you stamp.gov tips because we don't want you to go at it alone. Today's tip number nine is bonding. Listen, at Score Contracts, we take everyday people and help them win extraordinary contracts. So what is bonding? Chances are, if you don't know what it is, then it doesn't apply to you. But I understand, for all you curious Georges of the world hmm? who want to know what bonding is, bonding is for construction companies who provide actual services. Sometimes it also applies to real estate companies. But if you or your firm does not provide construction or real estate services, there's no need to do anything here. So you're off the hook. If you do provide construction services, make sure to fill out your bonding limit as per your terms, or if you're new to the business, just leave it blank. It's not a mandatory field, so feel free to skip it. It will not hurt your award chances in the future of doing business with a federal agency. Remember, when you put together the actual bid package, that's when the that stuff is gonna come into play. Thanks for watching and letting us empty your home today. I hope we answered all your questions. If this tip helped you, please make sure to leave a comment in the section below. Until next time, we'll see you.